to my channel. This is Amber's World. If you are new to this channel, welcome. I'm so glad that you found this video. I'm so glad that the fates have brought you to this channel. So I'm just going to get right into it. So um, to celebrate again, reaching another milestone in this channel, um, I wanted to do another what's in my bag video. A lot of you have responded well to now the two what's in my bag videos that I have posted. And you know, since I do kind of want to transition more into my passion for fashion on this channel, I think that I need to start just kind of making these regular videos because I do have quite a collection of bags um, that I own, that I love, and that are near and dear to my heart. And the collection just keeps on growing. And so another one that I kind of want to do with you guys that is pretty popular is this Louis Vuitton V tote a lot of you will find this bag familiar because I was gifted this bag back when I graduated from flight attendant training back in October so here's the bag now after like a month or so of really getting to know this bag and figuring this bag out i'm going to just kind of show you what i would carry in it on a regular day now mind you it is december so the items that i carry in this bag at this time during this season is probably going to be different from the items i would carry during the summertime but to give you just an idea of what can really fit in this bag this bag is really really spacious a lot can fit in here so even with the stuff that i put in here i'm probably gonna have a lot of space left over which i guess is a good problem to have the point is to fill the bag to the brim i kind of like my bags to be more um organized because a um a cluttered bag gives me like so much anxiety so of course this is really really cute bag on the go notice my little tag here with my initials on it one of my favorite parts about this bag what a lot of people don't know um about this bag there's a secret compartment on this bag that i have not used but if you unzip it here there's room in this compartment of this louis vuitton bag um my passport does not fit in here i don't have one of those tiny wallets but i don't know i guess you could fit like some chapstick some lip gloss but my thing is is like you know, the work that you would have to do to unzip this little compartment to try to fit your hand all the way in this bag, it's just, why bother? So unfortunately, I can't say that I have found a reason to use this little secret compartment yet. Maybe, maybe there's something that I want to hide real quick, but just so you know, that is um, a feature on this bag. Of course, the pink and green is a perfect, perfect feature. Like... I'm an AKA, as you guys know, so this was gifted um, for me um, with that in mind. So I love the color combination for this particular bag. Um, the hardware is nice and thick. I love some good gold hardware. And I like that the straps on here are black. It's just convenient. And um, this is the inside of the bag. The inside of the bag matches the olive green interior um, on the outside of the bag and um it's pretty dark but hopefully you guys can see like there's a lot of room in there and there's two pockets right there and then on the other side there are also pockets so you can fit some things here i just want to give you guys an opportunity to kind of see what you're dealing with or working with as terms of like space with all that said let me get into what i put in here wow this bag is huge <laughs> I have to remember not to block my face with this bag, okay? So first things first, makeup bag. Now this isn't the most important thing that's in the bag, but this is a bag that will be inside my bag. So any essentials makeup wise, I also put perfume in here. I also put my, um, what do I put in here? Oh, I also put any chargers in here. So my um, cell phone charger and I also put my iPad charger in here as well, um, just so that I can keep more things consolidated in one um space and i do put my chargers in like a ziploc bag before i put it in this bag because i know you guys are thinking okay um aren't you afraid of your makeup ruining your charger so that is the fix for that so i put that in there next are of course my cell phones i have a regular phone and i have a phone for work 
that I use. I'm a flight attendant for those of you who are watching this video or watching my channel for the very first time. So as I discussed in my flight attendant what's in my bag video, um, I have two phones. So naturally they're going to be with me everywhere I go. Whether I'm traveling um, for work or traveling for leisure, I just, I hate to say it, but my work phone is kind of always glued to me because I don't know, it's just out of habit. And next, I have my North Face gloves. It's getting cold outside, getting nipped outside. So these are definitely going to be in there as well. A mask. I mean, do I really even need to explain why? No, but a mask is, an extra mask is always going to be in my purse at all times. I have my Louis Vuitton passport. So I told myself that I was going to get an actual Louis Vuitton wallet for my bags. Um, but this passport, you guys, is so convenient. Like you, everything, not only can you fit your passport in here, but you can fit your cards in here. You can put cash in here. So I kind of haven't really felt the need to buy another wallet, but I'm going to. I'm going to one of these days. I'm going to. It's not really on my list of priorities right now, but this passport has like... This passport case is just, it serves multiple purposes for me. So naturally this will also be in here as well. Next is my work badge. This will most likely always be in my purse because even if I'm not traveling for work, I am definitely traveling for leisure and to surpass the security. I always want to make sure I have my badge so I can just go through the known crew member section of the airport. For those of you who don't know, known crew member section is for um, pilots and flight attendants and other personnel who can use it, who don't have to go through the regular security checkpoint, the more you know. So that is going to be in my bag. Um, you saw this also in my flight attendant what's in my bag video, my Lysol wipes and my Clorox cleanup wipes because I'm kind of a germaphobe at this point and I always wipe down whatever services I'm going to be touching or sitting down in. And then um, I'm wearing, the sun isn't really out much, but when I'm not wearing my glasses, when I'm wearing my contacts, I will have um, a pair of sunglasses. Um, so I have my Gucci sunglasses also gifted to me. Uh, thank you, auntie, you know who you are. Um, and then, yeah, I have that. So another thing that I wanna show you, and I'll have to switch cameras for this one. I can also put my iPad in this purse. And um, why would I carry a giant iPad in a purse? Usually if I'm traveling and I want to stow my um, iPad and I don't wanna just put it like um, of course it can't be stowed in the um, seat pockets, but if I just want to quickly throw it in somewhere, this purse will most likely be my carry-on. So I just conveniently stuff this in my purse and then put my purse under my um, seat. So this is what it looks like with all of those items in here. Like I said, this is a pretty spacious bag. Very, very convenient. This is definitely what I would consider a great travel bag. So I'm gonna just go ahead and end the video here. Again, hello to all of my new subscribers. I'm so glad that you um, have taken a chance on this channel. I'm so glad that my videos are entertaining you guys. So yeah. All right, so I really don't have much else to say. Um, I know that these videos are usually like a lot more posh, a lot more like luxury but i don't know this is this is just this is just me until next time bye